Hello everybody and welcome back to some more Peglin. We are jumping in once again, trying to see, uh, would you like, no, I'd like, I'd like to start a new one, please. Seeing if we can beat this Crucible again, it's, it's pretty difficult. We, we're having a hard time with this one, a really hard time. But anyways, we will jump in, see if we can do it. Uh, I do have to just give a prerequisite here. Um, yes, that sounds good to me. Um, a prerequisite here, the, um, today is the first of... January, so this is the day after New Year, New Year's Eve, should I say, and that means I'm pretty hungover, <laughs> like, pretty dang hungover, so, this is gonna be a relatively chill recording session, um, we're just gonna see how it goes, <laughs> but yeah, I'm pretty hungover, I drank, um, about a full bottle of rum last night, it was, it was good stuff, I enjoyed myself very much so, but, like I said, that does mean I am pretty messed up. <laughs> it's it's pretty late in the day as well. It's like half past four. It's been a while. Ooh, I will definitely take a large boulder. Thank you. Um, yeah, it's it's been it's been quite a while since I drank. Ooh, I would love, 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 love to get over there, but I just don't think it's going to be pl plausible. Yeah, I ended up going the other way. It's fine. Um, I can still get the elite, but I'd love to, love to have got on that item there. Um, shake the tree. Did we get an egg there? Is that what happened? We got an egg. Apparently there's a specific event you're supposed to keep the egg for. I don't know what event that is. Uh, some sort of castle event, I think. So we'll see if that that happens. Um, duplicate a random orb. Let's have a look. Oh, just a stone. It's bullshit. Sad times. Okay, do not. Do not take me to the left. You... Nope. <laughs> We're going again. I'm annoyed. That didn't go my way at all. <laughs> um, yeah, okay, let's do that. Yeah. I, uh, I was <laughs> very annoyed by that there. I wanted the chest and I wanted the elite and I got neither. So the game... The game's too rude to me, so we'll start up again. Uh, we're getting the bombs pretty early on here, though. But yeah, we do have to be pretty picky about our starts at the minute with the level of Crucible we're on. Because, as we saw before, it's it's pretty difficult. Last time, we had a, a pretty hard time. We don't, I don't even remember if we got past the first level. It's uh, it's really quite, quite a tricky situation for us at the minute. Uh, right now, I'm just trying to get the bombs and as much money as I can get. Um... I think I'm actually going to take a little bit of time here to um, to collect as many coins as I can before killing these guys, if plausible. It's not... There is two bombs here that are uh, potential that we're going to hit, so... Yeah, there you go. We didn't get everything we wanted there, but that's good enough. Um, shuffles the... Um, every six pegs hit. That seems decent. We'll take that. Um, and then I guess we can upgrade it. Yeah? Okay, that seems useful. Right. And this time we can actually go for the uh, the, the chest. But I just thought that this is a good game for me to record today. Because I wanted to record some stuff, but like not a lot. Ooh, interesting. I um, don't think it matters. Wait. No, it doesn't matter which one of these we take. So let's just fire it all the way over there. I'll take either of the green ones. Um, yeah, I'll take that. And then we shall see how this works. Oh, for fuck's sake, game. Why are you like this? <laughs> oh my god, why are you like this? Just give me what I want. At least we get a chest here, but goddamn. Game's rude to me. Uh, I'll take the Eye of the Turtle. I think the Eye of the Turtle's pretty good, and I'm a turtle too, so it makes sense. Um, and I don't know what our money situation is. No, it's it's really bad. There's literally no point in us going to the shop. It, our money situation is horrendous. I'd like to get rid of another stone here, but hey, uh, um, upgrade an orb. Let's upgrade the Swall Orb to level three here. And you, game, you better not. Oh. Don't you dare thank you. Oh my god, I was about to lose my shit then. <laughs> oh my goodness, I was about to lose my shit. But yeah, being able to move the, the refresh and stuff, I think it's going to be super, super, super good. Um, 
whenever we want to do that. This has unfortunately put us in a pretty rough position because the refresh, okay, so it's all the way down there, but if we can move it, it'll be fine. That's good. We got all of those on the three. We got a refresh in there. He is going to deal some good damage to us, but it's just par for the course. In fact, no, he's not because we killed him. Okay, that was a good kill on him. Um, the Swashbuckle Orb. Uh, money collected from hit contributes an additional one times damage. Um, I don't really know how good that is. I think I'm just going to go for another upgrade here and continue on. Um, we got here. When they move, they leave a stationary copy at their previous position. That sounds pretty good with the orb that we've got right now. I don't think the shop does anything for us here, so I'm just going to go go for a fight. Because we've, we've not got enough money. But so far, this is this is seeming like a pretty decent setup. I just need to get rid of more stones, really. So at the minute, I'm just kind of aiming for getting as many bombs as I can. These enemies aren't too bad. Okay, that didn't move any of them. Oh, oh wait, 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 no, it did. Okay. Okay, that is actually insanely strong as a combo. As combos go. And did that stationary copy stay there forever? It does. Wow, this is strong. Unfortunately, we are going to take quite a bit of damage here because I'm just having a just hell of a time hitting these bombs. Um, it's really not going our way, but honestly, yeah. This, this combo that we just picked up here is kind of ludicrous um, to the point of... This maybe be maybe could be a winning combo. We just gotta survive. So far though, we got really good health and stuff. We've only been hit a little bit. Um, yeah, for example, if we do this, yeah, okay. Look how many refreshes are on our board now. This is this is ludicrous. Um, we're gonna go for another one of these, and we're gonna upgrade it. I think we want to keep as many of those in our pocket as we possibly can, really. Uh, there's not really any point to going either way here, but I'll just take right, why not? Because there is a shop down here that might be useful. Um, plus one crit. The board will contain an additional crit. We need that. Not that we really need it, because we've got the reorganizer, or whatever it's called, but one additional crit's going to be better than adding plus one to all of our crits, I think. Uh, check behind the waterfall. Orb start with five pegs worth of damage. Sounds good to me. And then we try and go over here, but we know what'll happen. Oh no, we actually got where we wanted to go. We've had quite a lot of good uh, mysteries so far. Uh, one second. Apologies, I am back. My girlfriend just walked into my room, <laughs> incredibly disorientated after waking up from a nap. It was quite hilarious. She just came in and she was like, where are they? And I'm like, where are who? She's like, the other person that's here. I'm like, there's, there's no one else here. What are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> she was like, what? <laughs> and I think, because, like, we've both obviously had a pretty bad hangover, she just kind of woke up from a deep nap and was just extremely confused about why the people that was in her dreams are no longer here or something. It was it was quite funny. I'm going to open my drink that I just re retrieved as well. Poor little confused fella. It's funny, though. <laughs> oh. Okay, nice. Yeah, we are just going to cover the board in crits and stuff, aren't we? Like, <laughs> actually look at this. <laughs> like, just look at this. There's just crits and refreshes everywhere. It's nutty. We need that thing where if we hit multiple crits, it actually stacks the damage. We need, need to hit these bombs is what we need to do. There's one of them. So there you go. What the hell's this? Shock Absorber. Um, for each bomb detonated this battle. I think we're okay. I think we'll upgrade that. I'm going to continue on. Ah, I keep forgetting. I really should be trying to save money for um, removing st stones. Because it's 30. We could have we could have got that there. That's stupid of me. Oh, well. It is what it is. That was a bit dumb. Right. 
<laughs> Still think that was so funny. Why would you go over there, Orb? Do you want to hit as minimal things as you possibly can? Because it seems like that's what you're trying to do. We need to upgrade this as well, because our crits at the minute are pretty strong. Um, like, I mean, sorry, our ability to, to create crits is pretty strong. Awesome. Unfortunately, we got rid of all of our bombs there. Not being able to hit a crit when there's this many on the board is actually kind of ridiculous. Why do you, like, jump? Oh, my God, there's so many orbs in the middle. Just... Um, yeah, let's upgrade this bad boy. And it's on to the mole boss. I, I might try and get some more money here. Nah, I didn't get much. Mole boss? Eh, I don't know how this is going to go. We shall see. Ah, oh, come on, I almost got that crit. Not that I really needed it, to be fair. Nice one. Okay, we created a good few more thingies. No, we didn't create any more refreshes there, though, somehow. It's strange. There you go. We created a few more refreshes there. This guy is going to be slightly problematic. Being able to upgrade these orbs as well is pretty nice. Yeah, I don't like, particularly know how this boss is going to go, to be honest. Oh, my God. It keeps just falling into the abyss so quickly. Like, I honestly think we're going to take quite a lot of damage here and not get a very quick kill on this guy, so I'm gonna go for the bombs. Dude, stop missing everything, please. It's bumming me out. Get, get this bomb. We need that thing that stacks crits. That's gonna be absolutely absurd if we get that. Oh, come on. I just want to get that bomb, please. I'm, I'm losing health so rapidly here. Where did this bomb come from? I, I genuinely think we're going to die here, you know. I'm, I'm almost certain of it, which is a real shame because this run is awesome. But I'm just not killing the, um, the mole anywhere near quick enough. Like, I'm only ever hitting him with bombs and, like, piddly little shots and it's... Oh, it's annoying me. This, this was a, such a good run and it's been ruined, unfortunately. This was, like, the co one of the coolest runs I've had in ages and it's definitely going to die here. Hundred and sixty. Oh no, we got him. We got him. Okay, I really thought we were gonna die. At, it was gonna die there. Um, do I want to take another dag orb? I think I do. Cool. Um, and then what we got going on here? Multi-ball would be kind of interesting. I'm going to try multi-orb. It's This is potentially a bad idea. But my, my, my hope is that it'll generate more refreshes, more crits, all that sort of stuff. And we can get some stuff that works with that in the future. Right, look how many we've created there. That's pretty great. And then this thing comes in and generates even more plus threes or whatever. And that that gives us a bunch more damage. I think this could potentially work out. I mean, dealing 21 damage there is, doesn't work well, but... Now, I think overall this could be pretty good. I'm a little worried. It's these shield guys. We have no piercing. No piercing is such a big problem. Like, honestly... Such a big problem. Also, we have the thing on reload too, which is nice. This is just kind of a hard arena anyway. It's like, look at that. That absorbed that all of that damage. Why? It's basically guaranteed that we get crits here. Oh, God damn, this damage. It's not good enough at all. Finally, we managed to hit one of these bombs. Unfortunately, because we're refreshing so often, the bombs are actually really hard for us to hit. The crits are our saving grace, I think. I think they're our big damage. Look at that! 200 damage into the shield! It's just not fair, is it? It's just not fair. you left with 2 HP. Fuck you. That was a lot of health to lose on that fight, unfortunately. Um, upgrade that. 
honestly heal as well. And I think we go this way for the extra elites. I don't really care about this shop here, but if I could remove a stern, that would be really nice. But this won't do any damage to start with, unfortunately. But later down the line, it becomes very good. I think I think the problem's going to be that early on, we're just not going to be dealing a lot of damage at all. But once we get all our plus threes going, I mean, just look how many crits there are there. We need that one that, um, that increases... Yeah, we need that one that increases the amount of um, damage we can do on crits. So that's going to be absolutely ludicrous. Good thing is, these crit orbs are always going to deal huge damage. Like, this one's going near a thousand here. Oh, and it hit an enemy with 15 HP. Great, thanks game. Good job I bought that HP last time. Right, don't buy anything here. No upgrades, nothing. Straight for the shop, remove a stone. Okay, cool. I'm gonna try and go for the uh, elite here, but the game doesn't like me, so... Oh no, okay, we got it. Right. Unfortunately... Rocks before we get things going are really not very good at all. Okay, this this section over here is kind of crazy. I don't have to think about this. This is it's potentially got some really good stuff going on, but I think not having any sort of piercing is just I think I think it's just death. I think not having piercing now is is just instant death. Because we just did 400 damage and it just did it to one enemy that didn't need anywhere near as much of that damage. And, like, these guys are just wrecking the hell out of us. Like, it's not fair. <laughs> we're not hitting bombs anywhere near enough and they're not doing enough damage. And, yeah, we're just... We're just going to perish to, uh... Having too many of these enemies about. They all got healed there. Lovely. Exactly what we wanted to see. This is such a cool build, but it's... It's like, it's just missing the mark right now. That's another bomb, good. I mean, that's that's great damage, but it's going to deal it to an enemy that doesn't need anywhere near that amount of damage. And the shield is going to take five damage and ruin this entire shot. I'm going to deal all this damage, all 470, to a shield with five health. Just ridiculous. Come on now, game. Why? You're dead. This guy's gonna hit us for crazy damage. Ten. Oh my god, we're dead. Yep, we're dead. Come on, that was such a fun run. Why'd you have to do this to me, game? That was so cool. You ruined it. This crucible sucks ass. <laughs> Oh, I, that is one thing that I have to say. Like, so far, I absolutely love Peglin. I think it's great. But, I, I re, one thing I really think that they, and I, I actually can't believe the game hasn't, like, addressed yet. The over-reliance, an over, like, requirement on piercing is frankly kind of absurd. Like, once you get to the second floor, if you don't have piercing, you are basically just dead. Now, piercing is abundantly available. We did have multiple opportunities to grab it, but, like, that was one of the coolest builds I've ever had. And it had zero chance of ever winning on that floor. And that just, that's just saddening. That's just, that's just not okay. There should be much more opportunity for builds like that to kind of thrive and be able to make it forward when, at the minute, there just isn't. You have one of those builds and there's just a, a good chance it's just not going to go anywhere. Um, duh, 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 duh. Don't really know here. Maybe we go with the ball lightning. Uh, 
Um, go this way. Yeah, it's 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 just a shame, really. I think I think there needs to be some tweaking to that. I really don't like how. Uh, I really don't like how it does that. I might just give away a stone there, which is rather nice. Yeah, I really wish that that build could have thrived. That's pretty good. And we will attempt. To go down this way. A hey, nice one. Towards the elite. And then we can get the chest as well. We don't really need to get the bombs going yet. It just doesn't hurt. Okay, there you go. All the money. A crit there doesn't do much for us, but it does kill the final guy. I have to go for this. I got the crit as well, actually. I forgot that that was a... I, f I forgot that was a built-in crit, to be honest. Oh my god, come on. 16 damage with that orb. That could have been something so good. This elite's a really hard one, to be fair. You've just got not many pegs to hit, and... Um, the ball's gonna just fall a lot and do very minor damage like 36 and he's got 200 health my guy oh come on now i have to go straight down to hit this refresh and then it does that bullshit why okay we're getting close but we're taking way too much damage to this guy already there you go right Upgrade that bad boy. I've never actually done a level 3 stone, so there you go. Um, whenever you lose health, reduce the amount lost by 1. So, okay. Projectiles attacks have overflow. Prevent the first damage. I think we're going to go with the overflow. That seems really, really useful. That's kind of something we would have required earlier. But I'll take it now. And then... Enemies don't get their extra turns for your first reload. That's pretty good. I guess we'll go for the navigation one, though. Um, and then does it... I don't think it matters where we go here, so we want to take these for... Navigating? Or does that not count as navigation? Maybe it doesn't. Hit the crit straight away there. It's not a great strategy, because the bombs are better. But we kind of want to leave a lot of these bombs till later on. Doesn't matter. I hit them all. I don't think I've ever had a level 3 stone, you know. It's like the first time. There you go. That wasn't hard at all, was it? I'm just going to upgrade my stones, you know. Come on now, game. Don't be like this with me. This is going to be so hard for me to actually get in the place I want to go to. Hey, we did get a bit of healing there, though. I forgot about that. Lovely. Um, prevent the first time you would lose health each battle. I'll go with that, yeah. Seems good to me. And then, th this just doesn't matter whatsoever, so just try and get the bombs, I guess. It's very hard to get the bombs. There's a few things that guarantee it, apparently, but... Ah, we're taking care of the wrong navigations here, actually. Upgrade an orb. Get that stone to level 3. Yeah, so strategy I've not really tried before, but maybe making all our stones level 3 is going to be pretty good. Um, duplicate a random. If it duplicates my level one stone, I'm actually going to shit a, a whole brick. Um, so let's find out what it duplicated. Oh, it duplicated my dag orb. That's fine. It's not, the, it's not the one I was hoping for, really, but that is mostly fine. But yeah, with the overflow damage now, I think actually leveling up our stones is not a bad strategy. I was really hoping we'd get that crit there, but it's not looking likely now, is it? It's fine. Lovely, and then at the minute the refresh is just in such a ridiculously awful position. Come on. I have to go for a direct hit on it now, which is basically going to be a waste of a turn. Did Grant us a crit there, though? Nice. Probably should have re aimed that at the enemy with higher HP there, but that's whatever. Come on now. Why'd you got to bounce like that? <laughs> Why'd you got to bounce like that game? Look, d dude! I'm trying to aim it down here so it like bounces around in the little spiral and it's like, mm, no. 
Doesn't doesn't feel like it. Um read that bad boy. On to the mole boss. Oh wait, there's a slime boss. I actually prefer slime boss to mole boss because you can actually hit him more reliably. He does normally do more damage to you though, so. That's always a little scary. Um, we prevent that first damage, that's nice. I don't think we want to go for a crit here. I was trying, trying to go for the crit there, the, the bomb there, but it is what it is. Good, we get the refresh, and that is, of course, in turn a crit as well. Uh, Doing discards is not really a great idea, to be honest, on bosses like this. Okay, we finally hit the bomb. So it essentially gives him an extra uh, turn when we get close to our reloads. But if I can do more damage, I'm going to do more damage. Oh, God. My bounces are just horrendous. So we are inside it now. Look at that. Oh! I need to pay way more attention to where my things are going to bounce. Because some of these, yeah, some of these bounces are just horrendously bad. Like, what was that? What the fuck was that? That was just awful. And I've, I've not even gone for these outside bombs yet. Nine damage. Ooh, we're definitely going to live through this. We've got to deal 100 damage to him in this turn, otherwise things go bye-bye for us. And we're dead. Oh my god, this game. I love it. I love this game. But what the hell? It's so hard. The Crucibles, I might just turn off Crucible, you know? Like, it's just... It's just ridiculous. It's so hard. We've only unlocked like four of them. It's just, no, no more Crucible. Anyways, we'll leave that episode there for now. I hope you guys did enjoy. And yeah, I'll see you guys in the next one.